If your WooCommerce store receives hundreds of orders periodically, it is normal that a percentage of them fail, are cancelled or remain on hold due to payment issues. The problem is that these orders accumulate in our database, taking up space on our server. If you want to update the status of hundreds of orders manually in WooCommerce, the plugin will try to do it all at once, and your server can crash. Also, you could spend many hours depending on the number of orders you have to update. So, in this video we'll show you how to filter and change the status of your WooCommerce orders using the WooCommerce Orders Spreadsheet plugin. This plugin allows you to do advanced searches and apply bulk changes to your orders with a few clicks. You will be able to manage your orders using a spreadsheet inside WordPress. You will find the link to download the plugin in the video description, as well as a link to our written tutorial. You can use our search tool to filter all orders by keyword, selected products, order notes or use any other search parameter to help you find specific orders. For example, we'll search for all the orders whose payment is still pending to change the status to cancelled. For this, open the search tool and enable the advanced filters. Then, search for status. Leave equal as the operator. And select pending payment as the value. Finally, run the search, and all the orders whose payment is still pending will be shown in the spreadsheet. Then, open the bulk edit tool. Select this option to edit the filtered orders. Now, choose the status field. Then, enter set value. And select the cancelled status. Finally, execute and the status from all the selected orders will be changed to cancelled. Also, you can use our search tool to filter the failed orders to move them to trash or to delete them completely. For this, open the search tool and enable the advanced filters. Then, search for status. Select equal. And select failed as the value. Finally, run the search, and all the orders that failed will be shown in the spreadsheet. Once you've filtered the failed orders, let's see how to move them to the trash first. For this, open the bulk edit tool. Now let's select the status field. Select set value in this dropdown. And now choose trash. Finally, you need to execute and all the failed orders will be moved to the trash. With this option, you'll still be able to find the orders if you need to. If you want to completely remove the selected orders from your site and database, you will need to open the bulk editing tool. Then, select status as the field to edit. Choose set value. Enter delete completely here. Now just execute. and the orders will be removed completely from your site and database. It is clear that using the WooCommerce order spreadsheet will save you a lot of time and frustration, as you will avoid problems with the server because the plugin updates the orders in batches. Remember that you'll find a link to the written guide in the description of the video, as well as a link to download the plugin. You can get free live chat assistance on our website and access hundreds of tutorials. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, so you don't miss any of our tutorials.